Hello, and welcome to some Be Open. It is week 13, but this is your standard Be Open because it continues as regularly scheduled on week 13. And we are at Chicagoland, interestingly enough, this week. Uh, I have in the car a setup that was for last time <laughs> this car went to Chicago land so it's not completely modern but I don't think much has changed since this setup came out so I don't think it should be a problem hmm what is a problem is how loose this thing gets <laughs> I am going to be taking high lane <clears throat> Just because of how loose it gets, I'm going to put in a solid lap and then, I don't know, maybe I'll try something else after that, but I'm not even so sure. Felt like I really underdrove that, underdrove that, but hopefully it's not too bad and we'll try to improve on it here. So, first lap was a 30.861. Actually, that's my... That was faster than any of the laps I did. <laughs> it's funny. Uh, I think maybe the temperature of the track has changed. And in a way that makes the track faster, so that's interesting. And this lap will be even better. Hooray! So, we have ourselves a 30.781. Where's everyone else at? <clears throat> Excuse me. We got guys at 30.9, 31.0. Alright, so that's a pretty good lap. I can be happy with that. Uh, I set my tape to about 90%. I was afraid it would blow if I went any higher than that. So. Uh, although it looks like I would have been okay, because it's still not in the danger zone yet. So I probably could have put it at 100. There it goes. Just now starting to flash on the water temp side, so. I'm going to practice a. Green flag pit stop here real quick, and then I will head into or uh, hop out of the car because I can't really continue running around. This thing's gonna explode. So that's not fun. Oh hey, we got beat. Watch your speed. Good enough. As long as I can get on a pit road in a reasonable amount of time and not crush myself doing it, I am happy. So, I suppose we will get the camera ready for incidents after the race. Point this in the right direction. There's no real good marker for me to kind of see where to start lifting off and stuff for the green flag pit stop. So, it's been a little bit more tricky to figure out, but that should be okay, I think. That's pretty aggressive. You got people doing the back of the field exploit, which you can protest for. I'm not going to bother doing it. Um, I always assumed it was something that just had to be that way. <laughs> like, I, I already knew about it and that it was just something that... about how the system worked. That's why people were able to start in the back. But apparently, it is something they were not aware of, I guess, and so exploiting it like this is against the sporting code. I'm not going to be too stinky about it, but just so you know, if you start doing that, you could get protested and it could actually be upheld. Just a warning. Anyway, 54 is where the tape is supposed to be. It'd be okay. I got a 12 to 1 steering ratio, and I, I almost want to make it 10 to 1. It's that loose, but I got to draw the line somewhere. <laughs> and uh, I refuse to make it any lower than 12 to 1. It would seem that the right rear is wearing faster than the right front, which I hope is the case. I would like to fight the loose rather than the tight. Oh, hey, we're about to go here. 
Is that guy even going to get back in time? Okay, Colton. Your engine hmm. temperatures are okay. All clear on engine temperatures. Number one car That's might not be back in time. P3. Interesting. We're going to jump in the car with our P3 starting position. You'll be running out on the inside. Session P3 last lap ready. Road. Just try to be consistent. Definitely going to be running that higher line. Good luck, everybody. Early on. Oh, yeah, good luck. Because of how loose it gets. I am a little concerned. Oh, there's the one car. Yeah, good luck. Uh, I am a little concerned. By the way, I'm not going to race very hard at the start, so if you get a chance to go by me, I'm going to stay high. Okay, good to know. Um, I am worried it's going to be a bit of a mess. Um, unfortunately, races can, here can be a bit messy, but we've also got ourselves a single split. I believe, and it is a big field. We got like 34 people in here. So that's pretty interesting. I just hope we can get some green laps in. We have three sets of tires. I don't know if you noticed that. So. That should be enough, I think. We haven't got that data. My crew chief ready. And uh, I'm nervous, but I'm hoping it's going to be a good one. I'm a little out of practice, I will say that. Haven't been racing as much as I would like recently. I've been doing a lot of road racing when I do race. So. You have three. Additional sets of tires during the Maybe not as sharp run. as usual, but the only way you can get back into the groove of things is getting back out there. So, another thing I'm a little concerned about are these higher numbers in a single split race. They're apparently very fast. <laughs> uh, hopefully, they can hold on to it. 21 said he would be taking it easy. We need to follow car number so. zero five in the inside. Hopefully, uh, there'll be some smart approaches. Smart. Approaches from the peoples. I don't know. It sounded weird in my head. Out loud and in my head. Oh, wake up. Oh, people, let's go. My bad. Sorry. Apparently, the fourth place starter was sleeping. That's what that's about. Yeah, this looks like a first gear start. Well, maybe. I don't think this is a first gear start. Interesting. Bit of a quick shift, but we got enough room to uh, get a nice launch from first gear, so we will take it. We'll be watching this five car. We uh, got the best view in the house of him, so hopefully we can get a nice jump. Deep breath. We're gonna be going soon. Definitely got a better jump than second place. Oh, this is gonna be loose though. Watch out. Power through it. Oh, about that one. Ooh, he did not get a run off the corner. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Outside is clear. You're in first. You're leading. Why do you guys qualify if you just drop in the back? I don't understand it. Alright, so we find ourselves at the point for now. Called the Yonfu. And we didn't get an immediate caution, which I had kind of expected. I thought people were going to be getting loose in turns one, two, and they're going to be under yellow immediately, but that does not seem to be 
what happened, so that's curious. Let's try, try to stay on that right rear. It is curious because the uh, temperature is much different from what I was practicing in, so we got much more grip, so I think it's cooler. The track is cooler. That's what that would mean, I believe. Definitely want to be cutting the apron. You save a lot of time doing that here. I wish I didn't have to, because it gets a little bit unsettled when you do that, but it is what I am going to be doing. Maybe I should be going easier. I mean, I'm not going 100% necessarily, but kind of driving away from people. That's not really what I want to do. Maybe we will take things a little bit softer. That we have a little bit of a lead. We got the five behind us taking high line. That'll give them a really good run off. I'm kind of concerned that that would burn the tires pretty bad, though. Not really sure what I need to do to save the tires, but it's typically what happens if you run the high line. It is very tough on the car, so I will avoid doing that, I guess. Yeah, that felt good. I got some rotation down there when I did that. A little bit scary. But uh, if I can manage it, manage that loose feeling, then it'll be good for us in the long run. Just keep it on that edge. So. So far, so good. I love it. love that we're actually getting a green run to start. Is it a long green run? I don't know. But we are running still, and it is green. Thank you. So. We got people. Oh! Okay, I just smacked the wall. Well, if you're right up there, too. <laughs> Yeah, I think that's my lack of practice showing. <laughs> I did not get very much practice at a time, and I did not experience that tightness. Um, very different track temps. So that was interesting. That's not good for... Uh, that's not good for the car. <laughs> I'm glad it's not worse. I'm glad it didn't give me the old uh, the wheels are knocked out of alignment message or anything. But that's uh, that's not going to be good. We probably got some damage to fix now. So, remember when I was saying I was a little bit rusty? That's the kind of thing that's going to happen. <laughs> when you're feeling a little rusty. You're gonna smack the wall down for no reason. Let's not do that anymore. Thinking we probably have lost speed because of it. Not just gonna give it to them though because Oh, I am in the lead room, actually, so... We're three wide, we think, God. Stay high. Stay I'm gonna high. make him, uh... Oh, have to pass me as I run the high line. Which is gonna be frustrating, but it's gonna keep him back there a little bit. Frustrating for him, I mean. I get to run the high line, so I'm kinda happy. I can't believe I did that. I mean, I can, but I also can't. We're definitely down on power a little bit on the uh, on the straightaways, though, judging by how much he catches me, or, and did catch me. Where's he going? 
Does he have a uh, key tape on or something? Where'd he go? He petty? Where? Why'd you do that? That was weird. Huh. I don't know where he, he decided to go, but. No, we no longer need to fight him off, I guess. We are gonna go back. Actually, the higher line is working, apparently, because look at that. I felt like I was in good shape, and now I've given myself a damaged car, and a uh, tougher path ahead. Mm. Man, those bumps are brutal up here on that top line, in 3 and 4. Talking about that guy right behind me, though. Ooh, getting real loose. Interesting. I really do not have the best well, feel for this we'll yet. Say that. I will say I feel a little bit all over the place. And I'm gonna fight on the outside. They're gonna have to slide job me if they want to pass me, probably. Oh, uh, maybe not. They just did it. <laughs> what am I talking about? They just did it. Yeah, that can get by you guys. Oh. Really goes in soft there for some reason. Still inside. Clear inside. Fucking blind, maybe blind man. So you go. Car inside. Move. I can't believe we're green. I actually kind of hope that we get a caution now so I can fix some damage. But <laughs> then again, nice clean race is always good. So, oh, I hit the middle bumps. There's like some middle bumps in three and four too. We have bumps in the middle on entry. Bumps all throughout the corner. It feels like nice side. Yeah, nice. Good job. Next time I'm gonna wreck you. Still there. Why would you do that, man? It's a good move. Still inside. You can't hold the line and land on other people, dude. Yeah, cleared me. Car inside. Still there. Fight, fight. Clear. Horrible car right, right now. Well, he wanted to just let everybody pass it. Yeah, I've given myself a battle. Yeah. Dude, I'm just picking my battles, man. I'm just chilling. Yeah, I don't know what the 21 was doing. Like, he was up here in second. I mean, all of a sudden just backed out and decided to go to the rear or something. That was an interesting decision. I thought maybe he, like... Had too much tape on it or something and had to back off to not blow up. But apparently that's not the case. Apparently he's just uh, taking it easy. Keep high. 
God. Clear inside, inside. Stay high for the car on the low side. Stay high for the car. Uh oh, that guy's side. getting sideways. That was scary. Still there, inside. Clear. That guy's hitting the wall on the straightaway. Although the straightaway here is not exactly straight either. Got a little sideways, didn't you, Adam? I'm getting a lot of sideways at full time. I ran a lot of the high line and I've noticed that I think it chews up the rear tires bad. So I'm kind of just fighting right now not to lose a whole bunch of spots and maybe get the chance to get this thing fixed at some point. It's clear that I'm, I've got aerodynamic problems the way we're getting pulled on the straightaways. We're just being a pest right now and taking this high line, making them work to pass me. Uh, I'm not going to wreck myself or anyone else though doing it, so I'm only going to fight so hard. There's a handful though. Okay, I gotta stop doing that apparently because that just got sideways down there. I'm learning things. Imagine that. Chase the thing up the track there. Gosh, this thing's really loose. I like a loose race car, but this is too much. I'm holding out of this thing like crazy. I can't believe we've been green this whole time. I've probably been the one closest to wrecking. I think I'm gonna come in pit a little early. I mean, oh, can I do that though? I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I've really put myself in a bad situation here. I think I just have to hope for a caution, because it's not like I'm going to be able to fix very much damage, even if I do come in. I can't spend all the, a whole bunch of time fixing damage. You've just done 
Just getting, uh, we're getting caught and passed. <laughs> That's what we're doing. Clear as a cover sheet. Lame. Lame. Fix some of those damage. <sighs> Interesting. This 33 is going to have to go. If they have to pass us, although uh, it says we're good. So we'll see how bad the damage is. I hit the wall pretty darn hard. Now right, let's go. Let's stack them up. Let's go. Left us 33. Carbine. Check out, check out, check out. The leader is pitting now. Look out for the pit speed limit. Pit lane speed limit is 50 miles per hour. What? 50.9 gallons. We'll need to stop again to get to the end. Yeah, I don't think we can. F uh, we're going to have enough fuel to get to the end. Interesting. Five, three, two, one. Right here. 37.5 Hmm I think I gotta fix it So we're gonna go ahead and take it all We're gonna end up in the back Probably uh, give some distance and be very careful Because even though they didn't wreck at the start They could start wrecking now You know, so Hopefully this will help out my car that I had all messed up. Come on around me, Jason. I'm speeding. You should get out in plenty of time for the pace car. Move it, move it. All right, let's go. Line up single file. Get that five, Gas. Never did check my engine. Engine's fine. I had a feeling, but you never know with iRacing sometimes. You know, you scrape the wall and suddenly your engine's killed. Like, what? <laughs> what's going on there? But now we're good. Engine's fine, like I thought. It was just maybe some aero damage holding me back. So I'm going to be very patient here. And uh, watch out for guys sliding around. Not slide around myself. Try to stop that from happening. And uh, now I kind of know how the car is going to evolve a little bit better too. Maybe get out ahead of that. Nine apparently sped. Or something. I don't know what happened, but he's behind us now. We got uh, lots of distance to catch back up. Four gallons. Actually, four gallons, you say? If we're already back here, let's fill the fuel back up, maybe. Green. Would be interesting. You're on the outside okay, Colton, time. get ready. Race the regime at the end of this lap. Watch your speed. Boy, that hurt. We'll need to stop again. Let's just 15, fill it up. 10. Yeah, I went from 4th to 29th to 26th, I think. Two. Four One miles an hour. I didn't. Right here. I knew I was going to get it. I totally hit my foot. Okay, punch it. One to go. Next time by. Line up on the inside. Catch up. Nine. Go. Okay, I was going to hang back anyway and be careful, so I kind of prefer to be back here anyway. Three. 
3.3 gallons. About to go green, stay focused. 3.3 gallons. I think we could save that if we need. The pace car it's absolutely in. necessary. <laughs> green, 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 green. Let's go. Alright, so let's keep an eye out. 28 outside. Oh, there's so many people Clear in front of us right now. Clear outside if you want it. Driver in front of us is Wilson. Car outside. Go low. Outside, clear. Be patient. B26, you've just done a 33.8. Gotta do three wide Car shenanigans. Outside. Clear outside. Conscious of the fuels. Maybe that'll help me actually save tires for once, too. for sure. Oh, guy in the wall, guy in the wall. Ooh, guys are reacting to guy in the wall. <laughs> what we're looking at here. I mean. Two point eight gallons. Point eight gallons. Same, we're right on the edge. So last time I right oops. Going inside, backing off, I guess. Clear inside. Last time it said our right rear was more worn than our right front, which means I have to race it backwards and nor how I normally would think I would need to. Didn't mean to cut you off there, dude. God damn. <clears throat> You're good, 21. I figured you would probably try to move back. Yeah, he has mentioned before that he's trying to fall back, so... That's what that was, and not like a crazy block or something. So we're just going to gradually move forward. Maybe save some fuel while we do it. Just in case it goes green to the end. Exciting. At least, uh, at least that's something. 
even though I've uh, put myself in a bad spot. It's pretty exciting moving through the field. Actually being cut off. It was him just taking his normal line. I just didn't uh, expect to see him there. Uh oh, is that guy spinning? Is that someone spinning down there? Coming up on halfway here. Yeah. Keep it up, keep it up, keep digging. Okay, Colton, we're halfway. I saw someone down the well. Stuck. Just got this big wad of cars in front of us. Oh, that guy almost ran into that guy. This guy almost hit the guy. Commentary is so descriptive. Oh man, they're like three wide. They've been doing this three wide off and on for a while now. Not exactly what I want to see in front of me, but... Oh. And the eights hitting the bumps. It's kind of all over the track. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Outside is clear, outside. Still there. Stay low, outside clear. Alright. wall behind us maybe. Don't think I've uh, done horrible things to the tires this time around, thankfully. Thank you. Maybe you can start pushing a little bit more. Two, I'm still listening to what the uh, spotter says it has to say about fuel. Thank you. Air feels tight now. Weird. Certainly was not feeling tight the first run. I missed when it was loose, actually. I think I swung too far in the other direction. Interesting. Off bit higher. Clear. Thank you. Try to get back on that right rear again, but it's going to be hard now that the right front's worn. The next car is stands. There we go. I feel a little bit on that right rear. Maybe I should come down here then if it's if I want to get it sideways. So that certainly seems to work a lot of the time.
line felt pretty good. Felt like it was on the right rear. Man, I can't believe I did that to myself though, and I was in the lead. I just really messed up the car, and now I had to dig myself out of the Thank hole. You. Now it feels like we're just kind of stuck here. Starting to feel looser again, but it's not feeling fast either. I was pretty high up on the track. If that was by design or not. Just went for that extra high line. Hmm. Everyone's pretty spread out now. I should be saving more fuel. This thing is looking like it might go to the end. Saying sorry. Uh oh, I see smoke. It's happening. Can't see. If someone got spun down there or not. I saw a lap car maybe. Had issues. Point three. I think we're just gonna have to start paying attention to that. I'm going to start taking the low line, shortest way around the track, plus it's the line that requires us to lift off. Okay, Colton, the next car is Wolf. That's a blink. Two point two. Two point two. I think we should have plenty of time to save all that up. Too concerned. We could apron a little bit there. That's not good. Messed up my corner. That's good consistency. Keep it up. Got it in three, seven. Man, this thing just gets so loose. It's back to being crazy loose again. I just gotta be easier on exit, I think, on throttle. <laughs> Someone else got loose too, I assume. Going in the pitch, boys. You got a pitter. Point one. Ooh, the five is right on the rear end of the eleven. The lap time was thirty-three point zero. All right, Colton, you're reeling. Lower line's the way to go. Maybe it's just. 
gets too loose up there up top. I don't know. I really just haven't figured this place out yet. I need, where's my uh, Nick Neiman video? Gavin, I mean, maybe they have done it yet. I haven't really been able to, to look, see if they've uploaded, if they've done this combo yet this week, but I really got to see how they're doing it or something. Slow car, down low, go high. I'm staying low. Keep coming, guys, I'm staying low. Seems like we're starting to catch to this big pack ahead of us, though. One point eight. Yeah, I'm going to the end, man. No pitting for me. Big latency Figure spike out, up there man. in the top right. Don't like that. I'm going to be very upset if I get disconnected again from a race that I've been in for about an hour. <laughs> I don't think it's been an hour yet, but it's been long enough I don't want to be disconnected. Of course, I don't want to get disconnected on the first minute either. Let's not get disconnected. Okay, Compton, that's good consistency. Keep it up. Seems to be working out okay for me. I'm kind of making up ground, it feels like. Figuring out how to drive this thing, maybe. Not loose there. Got greedy on the throttle. Gotta be gentle. One point seven gallons. Hitting the flap. Yeah, other guys who don't think they can make it to the end. It was me gaining all that time I lost from getting loose. Someone up in the wall. Outside. I can't. I can't go down the apron. I thought about it. I don't think I was going to be able to hold on to it if I went down there. Back and more guys pitting, it looks like. Interesting. Five. Still think we can make it to the end. Oh! Don't overcorrect, oh my gosh. I had to let, let off in case he was about to overcorrect. I had to watch where he was. Stick out here at the moment. Clear. Oh my god, it's an L. I'm probably blinking. Gosh, this internet's the worst. Oh, no, I made it by. Oh, there are three wide behind us. 
just about snuck our way back into the top ten. With guys pitting and moving forward at the same time. 1.3 gallons. 1.3 gallons. Might not be in such a bad spot Sorry, after all, given we were like the only you. people to top off on fuel. We got a fast guy coming up. So let him buy easy. Still inside. Still there, hold your what are you doing? What is he doing? Just go. You've got clean. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm flustered because he scared me. He's got fresh tires. That should not have been tough on him. Just wasted my time. The captain Wolf behind us now, not protected. Hmm. We're gonna get guys on fresh tires, possibly spinning now, aren't we? Wow! Look at that. That guy has no control of his car. Sorry, Eleven, didn't mean to squeeze you. It's all good. Made me a little nervous, though. Roger. Oh, we got more fast people coming up on us. Stay high to the car on the low side. Clear. This is getting dicey. Car inside. Stay high to the car on the low side. Clear inside. <laughs> Power through the looseness. Really lift off there because they were side by side. What the hell, man? What's going on up there? One gallon, One gallon short. Hey, Greg, if you can put the yellow card on the wall, I greatly appreciate it. Lord, what do you do? Outside. Keep low. Clear outside. Well, this sure has been intense. Very strange way this race has unfolded for me, but it's been exciting. Can't say it hasn't been. I'm able to pull it back into the top 10 after this whole adventure. I think I'm okay. I'm okay with that. I wonder if we're going to have anyone else that runs out of fuel or anything. Zero. Great job. Great to go. Come back. Was at 33.2. We're having this 13. We're about the same speed as them, I think.
Bring up caution. X-27. Slow down, down low. Go high. Lap car gets a lead lap car, it looks like. Position. Crash out of caution. Yeah. Did they really just like pull on track or something? Of course they would be, yeah. We're under caution. Brick! You guys suck. Catch fast 13, car. Oh, dude, it was so predictable. It wasn't funny, man. Someone was going to cause one. I had a good fuel strategy, too. I would have made it then. Yeah, I was three laps too good, so... I think most of the guys up front were going to make it. Steve and Ricky, would you have made it? Well, now we're just going to have to go, and this is going to be scary. Go. Yeah. That was good to make it. I was clutching and everything. 25, catch them. 31, catch up, go. The leader, Massey, is pitting. Look out for the pit speed limit. Okay, Colton, we'll fuel you to the end of the race. Pit box in 10, 5, 3, 2, Checking up in 1, one. right here. 39, 32, interesting. Let's go, let's go, let's go. All clear, function. Be mindful, you only have one set of tires remaining. Line up, single right, I don't know where we are, but... It's go time now, there's no saving tires necessary. Let's see what, <laughs> what we got on a short run. I think we're better on a short run than a long run. Even though we were moving forward there. Hopefully we gain some spots on pit road. It's our open. So on seventh, but that's just because when we cross the line in pit road. So I don't know where we actually are. From eleventh to we'll find out. But I know we passed the guy behind us. He was in front of us. I thought I want you. Well, we went from 11th to 10th, so we just passed the one guy, I guess. <laughs> oh boy. It's gonna be interesting. Are we gonna catch up or what? With the fire. Going in the three. Huh. So, that's either going to help us, I think, or we're going to end up in a smoldering scrap heap <laughs> before the end of this one. I don't know if there's much in between. Lots of people getting way around it looks like. Line up on the outside. Get stuff nine. Five left to go. It's gonna do a second gear start, I think. Hmm. Be smart about this too. Now, if you go outside that restart zone, do you get black flag? No, it's not active in rank uh, racer yet. Oh yeah, they're bringing the restart zone, the Gecko restart zone to iRacing. That's exciting. 
Can't wait to learn all about that. See how that works out. That could really help certain tracks, like uh, the latest updated Phoenix. Hopefully that is implemented very well and doesn't have any annoying bugs to deal with. To go green. Stay focused. The pace car is in. Uh, that lane does not go. That's annoying. Oh, I'm so trapped right now. Got trapped so bad there. I lost a bunch of time. I feel like I could have moved forward more, but. Oh, it's so tight. I got arrow push or something. That's not good. Well, we brought it back to the top ten. Good win, Steve. I hate whoever brought out the last car. Good job. Very good job. And how much did you get me by, Cohen? Couldn't be but a foot. Woo! Nice race, gentlemen. Yeah, I hope you guys go back and check to see what brought that caution out. See if it's protestable to stop crap like that. It's really annoying. Cautions that they both caught me. <laughs> Why would you stop there? Come on, dude. Why would you stop in the middle of the track? Seriously. What's your speed limit in the pits? <laughs> Apparently the fun continues after the race. Eighth. I feel like I could have done better, but... Just drive to the pit lane. Drive on the track if you're going to go to the pit lane. Don't go on the apron. Hmm. Exactly. Stay on the track if you're going to go to the apron. If you're going to stop and go to the apron, it's not that hard. And if there's cars stopping in front of you, don't run into them. All right, we'll see the incidents. Um, I'm, I know I'm kind of quiet. I'm just thinking about all that. Good race there, Seven. I meant to say that. Good one, Steve. Thanks, Jason. We'll just see the good old W. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Yeah, Jason, you definitely need to learn how to get to pit road and don't stop on the track. That is not a thing. You need to just shut up. Like and me smacking the wall, first thing that happens. Oh. The beginning of the end. <laughs> the downfall. I just, I don't know. I In the practice I was in, the track was much hotter. Or something. I just, it, it started pushing. 
<laughs> I don't have any good yeah, explanation. 24 got in the wall. That'd be better. Well, 27 got in the wall. And uh, 6 had nowhere to go. So it looks like the 5 ran out of talent of lap 15. Screwed my race. Scary situation there, three wide with the five. Ooh, very close there. Oh boy. Looks like the 27 entered low and didn't slow down enough. Or it actually kind of looked like they were moving up the track instead of turning into the corner. So they can't get the thing to turn unless they lift off really hard and they just do it right in front of the 20. That's just a bad set of circumstances there. Some wall hits. Just gonna try to make my, uh, my, make my way through those real quick. Way overdrives. Ooh. No one uh, gets spun around though, so no caution there, I don't like. Some guys are getting real tight. It's really interesting how, depending on how you run, you can either get tight or loose. Ooh. 20 barely is able to hold on to it. 13 pulls a me. At least I'm not the only one. Even if I was the first one, and I did it from first place and set my whole race down a not so good path. <laughs> I can't feel too bad still with what I got. Zero X. And uh, still got the top 10. Yeah, we got some pitting issues going on here. Serious pitting issues. Nineteen. Gets bounced around. Hmm. That code did some weird things with that one. 18 well off the pace, and then they just uh, hit the safer, but safer barrier. At least it was a softened impact. Three up in the wall. Ooh, drifting around the corner. <laughs> 29 trying to slow it down. Woo! 13 barely keeps it off. Oh, this is a 28 swerving around. I, I thought he hit the wall whenever I saw him, but apparently he was able to keep it off just barely. Team drives in a bit hard, maybe. That old Xfinity wiggle on the straightaways you get. Gets drifty. It'd have been interesting to see how many people could make it to the end, but I have the feeling everybody in the top 11, you know, where I was and uh, in front of me, feel like they all could have made it. It wasn't too much to save, I don't think. Rick, are you still on here? What's that? I think 
I don't think he's talking to me. Some weird stuff going on with the fire. Rear end damage that appears and goes away. Some wall hits. Nothing too much to see. Ten had a rough race. They were laps down from very early on, and they just forget to slow down for the corner there. Yikes. It's going to be a hard wall hit. Oof. That thing didn't turn at all. Five had a very similar race to me. <laughs> they uh, hit the wall about the same time as I did. And then they were around me the rest of the race. <laughs> they end up finishing. Oh, they had problems. Do I remember that happening? I don't know. Maybe I don't. What did I do? Oh, probably 50% uh, on the tires. I got guys clutching. I topped off, so I was feeling pretty good. I didn't really even have to save too much. I just kind of decided to take that lower line, which required me to lift off more, and that seemed to be good enough for me. It was probably just better in the long run anyway. Yeah, what I'm talking about there. Bunch of guys wearing the tires. Ugh, 31 just kills the 17. That's frustrating. Where you want to enter? doesn't really get an angle on the corner and then just it doesn't turn for him and then 17 is the one that pays for it because the universe just isn't fair we're gonna find out what that caution was pretty soon here to the five did he have to pit he must have had to pit so I guess that's what happened to him This is under caution. I don't know why we're seeing that. That, <laughs> for that matter. I don't know why I stared at that for so long. I was like, what's that noise? I was like hearing weird noises. And I feel like I could have moved forward more, but I just got so stuck behind guys and I wasn't about to wreck anyone or anything so awful jump in front of us to start with nine just does not go so that kills all of our forward momentum right off the start and then I'm um, on the outside, so I have to push hard out there. And then the run I get, I get boxed in. And I wasn't about to just try to thread that needle. I just, it's not worth it. So then I'm like, all right, I'm still up here. I'll try it again. I'll try to get the run again. And I get it, but I'm up here and it's curved front straightaway, so. Long the way around, and then I'm like, all right, which way is the nine going? And I couldn't figure it out. I was like, are they going to take the high line? Are they going to take the low line? I was trying to pick what they didn't pick, and uh, I did not succeed at that. <laughs> so that kind of messed up my corner. And then uh, coming into three here, high line's just not the best place to be. 
Nine, like, gets the apron or something. That's what allows us to get around there outside here. Here, I'm like, all right, I'm going to take that high line. But then the six is super slow. <laughs> so I get stuck behind them. This is the line I want to take, and they're taking, like, the middle in here, and they're like, I don't know where they're going to go, but just barely able to get to their outside, and suddenly we're three wide. I stay in my lane. They get kind of weird down there. The six kind of... Is a little too low, maybe. I mean, you can just look at the lines on the track. That's a decent indicator where you need to be. I'm in my lane. They're kind of like far over there. and They're kind of pinching up on that lane, so they come together. Thankfully, it doesn't come up and get me. But I see I got space down there, so... I take my angle under the corner. And then, this is from all that nonsense. This is the gap we have in front of us, and... I don't think we're going to be able to go much more further than that. And, uh, probably should have been taking that lower line. That got weirdly tight there, even though there was fresh tires. Not sure why that would be a thing, but it got tight, and I was expecting super loose. But thankfully we were able to hold off the 9 and still, uh, get our 8th place finish. So that's how that ended up. All right, enough dwelling on it. Um, I'm not not thrilled about this finish, but it should be okay. I'll probably lose just a couple I rating, but who cares about that? Clean race. Uh, I just feel like I left some on the table, but oh well. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Hopefully, pretty soon here. <laughs> see you there.